Are you ready to get that big fat worship snare drum tone like this? You literally just need these two things. I'm telling you. Hey guys, what's up? I'm Ryan. Thank you so much for stopping by. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to tune your snare drum to make it sound big, fat, and get that tone that you've always been wanting on your snare drum. Let's go. All right, for starters, all you're gonna need is a tune bot right here, drum key, and a drumstick. I'm gonna link all the settings that I have in the description below, so be sure to check that out. I think the easiest way to start when you're tuning drums is actually to start with the bottom head not the top head because believe it or not, a lot of that attack and that crack that you're gonna get when you're playing your snare drum is actually gonna come from your rezzo head. So let's go on over to a different spot and I'll walk you through my entire process of how I do this week in and week out when I'm tuning my snare drum. All right guys, so I've got my bottom rezzo head here. Um, I like to use a little bit of padding when I'm tuning my, my snare drum specifically or just my drums in general. That way I'm only hearing one side of the head at a time. I don't wanna hear both sides. Specifically when you're using a tune bot, you really wanna make sure you're getting just this side frequency and not the other one. Okay, so what we're going for with this tune bot, 400 hertz on the bottom head. That is the secret sauce to this entire thing. We wanna make sure that we get our bottom head really nice and crunchy. So it's really important when you're doing the bottom head to get something underneath those snare wires. You don't wanna have the snare wires rattling when you're tuning this rezzo head. Basically when we're tuning snare drums or just drums in general, we wanna tune them in cross patterns, right? We don't wanna just tune one by one by one. We wanna go diagonally. So think of this right here as one, essentially one lug. These two need to be in harmony with each other. So this one was at 347, let's see what this one's at. So 349, okay, let's check this one. 338, that's kind of low. So let's go over here. There we go. And you can tell the difference too, when I switch to 400, it's a very distinct note, that's a G4. So tune each lug to 400 hertz for the rezzo head. Now let's flip it over, let's go to the top head. All right, we've got our batter head side down now. What we're going for, uh, for each lug on the batter head side is in between 215 to 235. This is really up to you. I really like using 215. I just feel like it has a little bit more thud. Uh, let's just kind of see where we're at. So we're pretty low right now. We're about 140, 140 134, 130. So these are significantly lower. So. Uh, I'm gonna crank these up a lot. So I'm gonna start here and go across. Remember, we work in cross patterns. Okay, so we're a little high. That's at 237, which is fine. That's 245, that's fine. Bring this down. And this is why I love the tune bot, because you're getting the actual frequency of what you're tuning it to. That's still really high. Let's tune that down. And notice how when I just mess, mess with one lug, it really changes. Each lug is, is tuned. So if you really tune down one lug, it's going to affect all the others. Love that. We're going for 215 on the top head, the batter head, that's what we're going for. Rezzo head, each lug, tune it to 400 hertz. All right, let's go put this on the kit and see how it sounds. Hey, one quick thing I wanna to mention too is this Richie ring. I don't know if you can see it. Oh yeah, awesome. This is a really great dampener that you can use in addition to a good moon gel. This will get your snare drum sounding really, really nice. But let's see how this thing sounds, let's do it.
And that is how you get that big, fat worship tone that we're all looking for. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be on the lookout for another set of videos regarding tom tunings uh, and kick drum tunings. Man, we're going to go through the entire setup uh, as far as tuning drums goes. And uh, man, thank you guys for sticking around. Peace.